Hi, my name is Consuelo. Welcome to the channel and welcome to this shoulder stretch yoga practice. So get ready and let's begin. So come to your standing position. Uh, feet are hip distance apart. Bend the knees a little bit. Place one hand on the belly, one hand on the chest. Long straight spine, close the eyes. And we just take three deep breaths to get grounded and center on your yoga mat. So take a deep breath in. Exhale, out through the mouth. Breathe in. And out. And last time, breathe in. And out. Then open the eyes. Inhale to reach the arms up, palms to touch above your head, and then flip the palms and press the arms down. Like you're pressing through water or honey. Inhale, reach up, so feel the resistance in your shoulders and arms. Flip the palms and exhale, press down. One more time, inhale, reach up. And then flip the palms and press. And then interlace your hands behind your back so you can interlace in this way or catch opposite hands to opposite elbow. Sit our hip with distance apart. Roll the shoulders back. Take a deep breath in. Bend the knees and fold forward. Let your head hang down towards the floor and bring, if you can, the palms together to touch. Now look over towards the right and let your uh, grip your hand, hands and arm move over towards the left. And exhale back to center and turn over towards the left with the arms moving to the opposite direction. And come back to center. Release your hands, chin to chest, roll up to standing, one vertebra at a time. Inhale, reaching the arms up. And exhale, palms together at your heart center. Take a deep breath in. And exhale. Now bring your hands on your uh, shoulders, elbows wide. Start to make circles, so inhale, elbows forward and up, and exhale, back and down. So make the movement as wide as you can, but yeah, do what, what you can and feel good about it, like one of my teachers has. and then change direction. So inhale, go up and exhale, forward and down. Keep your navel hugged in towards the spine. So you protect your low back and you avoid like arching and puffing uh, arching the spine and puffing the chest forward. You want a long, straight spine. And now inhale, come back to center, elbows wide, bend the knees. Exhale. Now inhale, turn over towards the left, so opposite, the, you, what you've seen on the screen. And exhale, twist over towards the right. Try to keep the hips and the legs um, like uh, still, like they don't move, only the upper body moves. So you breathe in and out through your nose, find your pace. So only the upper spine rotates, the hips and legs don't move but they're still working to give you that stability 
and that strength of your foundation. Keep going. And then come back to center, take a deep breath in, hold the breath, reach the elbows right and left. And exhale, release. Come to Tadasana, palms facing forward, maybe close the eyes for a moment. And just notice the sensations in the shoulders and arms, maybe hands. Take a deep breath in and exhale through the mouth <sighs> and open the eyes reach the arms up bend the right elbow and use your left hand to pull uh, the right elbow over towards the left bend the knees a little bit and come to a side body stretch so keep pushing the back of the head into your uh, arm and the hips are moving over towards the right. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more time. Breathe in. And out. And then come back to center. We do the other side. Reach both arms up and then bend your left elbow. Catch it with your right hand. Bend the knees a little bit and start to pull the elbow over towards the right and you also lean over towards uh, the right with your upper body pushing the hips towards the left so notice if your chest is pointing down towards the floor lift it up sternum reaching forward breathe in and out and then come back to center, release, come to a wide stance, so with the toes pointing out, heels in, inhale, reach the arms up, and exhale, bend the knees and bend the elbows to cactus arms, spread your fingers super wide and uh, squeeze your shoulder blades, inhale to reach up, palms to touch, exhale, goddess pose, squeeze the shoulder blades, Again, one more time, breathe in, exhale, cactus arms, look up towards the ceiling, baby back bend, and then keep the legs as they are, reach the arms forward, right elbow under uh, the left, and come to eagle arms, or catch opposite hands to opposite uh, shoulder. And stay in goddess pose, with, this, uh, with your own arm variation. If you are in eagle, push the shoulders down, away from the ears and the forearms away from your face. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. And out. And then press up, release. Turn your toes uh, in, heels out. Hands at your hips with long straight spine. Take a deep breath in and exhale, hinge at your hips and come with the chest parallel on the floor. Tuck the chin in and then left hand underneath your face on the floor or on a yoga block and you reach the right arm up. If you can't reach the right arm up, you can place your right um, hand on your sacrum. Breathe in, breathe out, one more time, breathe in and out and then swap hands, right hand on the floor or on a block, left hand on the sacrum or reaching up towards the ceiling. A couple of breaths here. So your choice if you want to breathe out from the nose or the mouth. And then come back to center, place your hands at your hips, press into your feet, come all the way up 
And again, toes out, heels in, inhale, reach up. And exhale, goddess pose with cactus arms. Spread the fingers and squeeze the shoulder blades. Breathe in, come up. Exhale, goddess pose. One more time. And now stay here. Look up towards the ceiling, baby back bend. And then reach the arms forward, this time um, left arm under. Come to eagle arms or catch opposite hands to opposite shoulder. And then sit a little bit lower into your goddess pose, pulling the shoulders away from the ears and the forearms away from the face. Really stretching out the space between the shoulder blades. So you can also imagine, imagine the shoulder blades moving out to the right and left, away from each other. Breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, and out, and then press up, release, bring your feet closer, shake it out, and then uh, feet are hip with distance apart, bend the knees. And we do some shoulder shrugs. So in, squeeze and lift the shoulders up towards the ears and exhale, let them drop down. And exhale through the mouth. Inhale. Exhale. Keep going. You can do it slow or fast, your choice. Squeeze and lift, hold the breath, squeeze the face, and exhale, release. <sighs> Stay a moment in Tadasana, close the eyes, palms facing forward, mountain pose. <sighs> and open the eyes, come on your hands and knees. And we come to puppy pose. So keep your hips on top of the knees. You can have option to come on your forearms. Or if you want more stretch, you can walk your hands forward, lifting the elbows off the floor. And then let the head, the forehead rest on the yoga mat. And you imagine your heart center, your chest is reaching down towards the earth. So there is no active pushing. Allow gravity to do the work for you. Close the eyes and take five deep breaths here. And then come up to all fours. And we finish the practice in extended child's pose. So bring your uh, toes to touch, knees wide. Come all the way down. If you cannot come all the way down, you have always an option to rest on your forearms. Otherwise, come down, close the eyes, and see if you can bring the palms together to touch reaching the arms forward, the hips towards your uh, heels, and then bend the elbows and come to shark fin with your hands, like walking the elbows forward for a final deep stretch of the shoulders and armpits. And 
then a deep breath in. Sigh out through the mouth. And if you can keep in the eyes closed, come up to a seated position so we can seal the practice with one arm. Rub the palms of the hands. And then press the palms in front of your heart center in prayer pose. Long straight spine. Take a deep breath in. Raise your thumb knuckles to the forehead. Namaste. Thank you for practicing with me today. I hope your shoulders feel more free and open. Uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to the channel, and I hope to see you here very soon. Bye.